Hi, I'm Annie Taylor-Joy, and these are the five lessons in royalty and leadership that I learned by playing Princess Peach. Watch and learn. Tip number one, be compassionate. When Mario showed up at her castle, Peach could have easily turned him away. She had an entire kingdom to protect. Uh, who's he? And he was just a tiny plumber. Found the problem. But by listening to Mario's problems, and agreeing to help him, Peach not only made a new friend. Who, me? <laughs> she also gained a new ally in her fight against Bowser. Does the princess like him? Oh, sire. Which brings me to tip number two. Being a leader isn't always about being the best. It's also about bringing out the best in others. Remember when Mario tried that training course? <laughs> He kept failing and failing and failing. Peach could have stormed off and fought Bowser herself. But instead, she spent the entire day working with Mario to make him a more powerful fighter. Come on, try again. With that training, Mario earned the trust of the Kong Kingdom and saved his brother. Blue! Mario! <laughs> no big deal. Tip number three. You're not defined by where you came from. When Peach arrived in the Mushroom Kingdom, she didn't have any friends or family with her. She had nothing in common with the toads who found her either. But by being compassionate and helpful, remember points one and two? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Peach gained a new family of toads who respect and admire her. She can do anything. So don't let the past define you. Tomorrow is a new day. Come on, guys! Da -da 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 -da. Okay, tip number four. It's not all about the dresses. Dresses are beautiful, obviously. Oh, yes! But sometimes the job calls for a motorcycle jacket. <laughs> yeah! Plumbers wearing white gloves? Just wear what makes you feel happy and helps you get the job done. Mm -hmm. And last but not least, tip number five. Surround yourself with people and things you love. When you think about it, Bowser has everything Peach does. He rules his own kingdom, has his own throne room, and a massive army. I know that. But the one thing he doesn't have is love. You ruined my wedding! That's why he's always searching for new worlds to conquer and a princess to marry. We can rule the world together. Peach doesn't want to conquer other kingdoms because she loves what she already has. So appreciate what you've got, and you'll become a Peach and not a Bowser. And that concludes my guide to modern leadership.